Hey everybody, really looking forward to uh, getting into recording for our worship service this weekend. A uh, few things that I just want to update you on real quick as we are coming up to the weekend. First of all, thank you all so much for the way that you are praying for and caring for, for Lee Cantu. Continue to be just lifting her up in prayer. Just want to let you know, uh, I'm sure many of you have heard, uh, Oscar's funeral service will be on Tuesday at 2 o'clock out at Earthman's Funeral Home. Um, there's only 10 family members that are going to be able to actually be at the graveside. Uh, if you'd like to be, uh, if you'd like to just drive up there and be in the parking lot during the service, you can do that. Uh, but you're probably not going to be able to see very much and you're, you're probably not going to be able to hear anything. But again, if for some people it's really important just to be there and if you'd like to do that, that'd be awesome. We are, as a church, we are looking to organize some way that we can really show our support for Lee as well. We may even just drive by her house so that we can just kind of wave at her and pray for her later on that afternoon. On Monday, you'll get all the details for that, so make sure you just check back there uh, for those things. Also, Mother's Day is coming up, and we are really looking to bless our moms in a, in a special way. What we would love for you to do is share uh, a little testimonial, uh, either on video or even a graphic. Maybe you have a family picture that you could just put a little note with or something there. Send those into info at hfcog.org and we're going to put all those together. We're going to make a little compilation video at the end of the worship service on Mother's Day. It's going to be a really awesome tribute and I hope that you are a part of that as well. Awesome. We also have our um, uh, Kambalachi offering uh, coming up here. And I know for many of you, this is the, you save up your change and everything, and you're ready to put it in the, the plate there. But um, what do we do when we're not in the building, right? So we want to encourage you to actually get a jar, keep it in your house there, put all your change in it. And then uh, once we're all back in the building, we can, we can make that uh, grand offering to them. That way we can continue to support the village there in in Kambalache. Last thing that I want to mention to you then is uh, I mentioned last week the online national disciple making forum. Uh, this is a free uh, resource and you are going to learn so much about how to be a disciple maker right where you are. No matter how long you've been walking with Jesus, there's something that you can learn in this. Make sure you go to discipleship.org, get registered for that. If you have any questions, feel free to email me at pastortim at hfcog.org and uh, we'd love to get you connected. Also, so let us know you're going to be there. Uh, we've got an event uh, page on Facebook where you can just click that you're going to that, or you can even go to hfcog.org slash church online. And at the very bottom of the page, you can fill out the information form to say, yes, I'm definitely going to be there. Can't wait to be a part of it. Uh, church, just know that we are praying for you. We're excited about what God is, is doing here. Make sure you keep up with those phone calls. Keep up with those invitations. Make sure you're sharing links with people so that they can get connected to what God is doing through Houston First Church of God. Um, he's on the move. God is on the move. I'm hearing so many testimonies about how his word is getting out. Let's all be a part of making that happen. Church, I love you. Can't wait to see you again. Bye-bye.